Okay, this is Kendall Lockwood Entrepreneur. I'm coming to you with another quick video and I'm going to talk to you a little bit about HP calculators. This is a vintage HP um, and this is a 19B2 uh, second series or whatever you would call it, business consultant, as you see there. Okay, and uh, what I'm tr the point I'm trying to get across in this is um, look at this old stuff that don't seem like it would be relevant in today's market. Uh, this particular calculator is not one of the highest de desired uh, calculators, but um, it is pretty desired. These can go upwards if you complete with manual and all that kind of stuff, um, upwards of uh, 200 bucks uh, or more. Um, this particular one I'm looking to get maybe between, depending on how long I want to wait between 50 and 100 bucks. I'm uh, going to put it up there for 100 bucks, probably. Um, but anyway, this particular calculator, there's some other models, um, common models that were uh, made back in the early 80s. The uh, 32S um, RPN calculators, I've sold hundreds of those. Um, I used to get them um, when schools upgraded their equipment. Um, and these uh, engineer type uh, companies, state departments, and all that kind of stuff. But anyway, um, the thing you got to note on this particular model here is it has the end type battery, which you can find those at Walmart. It's probably about 10 bucks worth of batteries here, 12 bucks or so, because there's three of them. And I also used to find these batteries at the Dollar Tree. So whenever you go to the Dollar Tree, try to pick up. Um, weird size batteries and so um, yes be on the lookout for older HP calculators and older uh, Texas instrument calculators and real quickly while it's on my mind I'll show you another one this is a, a HP 12C um, I believe they still make this model sorry about that this is a uh, got one hand holding this this phone I'm not the video the video guy but yeah this is a 12c they still make these but this is a this is an old one this one was made in brazil um so it's older i think they made them in the u.s and, and then there's a uh, singapore models i believe um but uh anyway the 12c 11c um the 48 uh 48 series um gx the g's aren't really worth much anymore but, um, yeah, keep an eye out for vintage calculators. And I don't know if I uh, mentioned that I paid 50 cents for this one uh, today. So, keep an eye out for those and you can make a nice return. Talk to you later.